mystery that began with a startling discovery in Youngstown now has a conclusion. A woman searching for her lost dog in these woods a few weeks ago on the East End stumbled upon a pile of bones. Now, police at that time wouldn't say if those bones were human. Today, though, their investigation is complete. Our First News senior reporter, Jerry Ricciuti, just left a news conference with YPD and the coroner's office. Jerry, what did they reveal? Chelsea, we can tell you that the family of a Youngstown woman missing nearly five years now knows a little bit more about what became of her, but there are a lot more questions now than there were before. This morning, as you said, Youngstown police confirmed a set of bones recovered in an area, wooded area, off the east side of Youngstown, wrapped in cloth is that of missing woman Amy Hambrick. Now she disappeared back in November of 2017 after leaving her home on the e on the west side to go visit friends in the North Jackson area. In the end, dental records were used over the last couple of weeks to positively identify the bones as hers, but at this point the police are saying the cause of death in this case is going to remain undetermined. They will continue doing testing on those remains to see if it leads them any further. In the meantime, police are asking anyone who might have information, especially since these bones were left in cloth and left to be found at a later date, someone may know what happened to Amy Hambrick and that that person will come forward. We'll hear more from police later on First News. For now, in downtown Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News at noon. Chelsea.